2023 has started out a La Nina year, but what does that really mean? Well, I'm glad you asked. I would love to tell you. La Nina refers to the temperature in the Pacific Ocean. In La Nina years, it's especially cold and we have especially strong winds towards the equator. This means in the southeast in the wintertime, we'll have warmer temperatures and drier conditions. And it also leads to a more likely springtime tornado season. But here's the catch. La Nina is ending and soon will be in a neutral phase and eventually turn to El Nino by the time we get to end of summer and beginning of spring. Let's walk through exactly how it all happens. Well, first it starts with strong winds called trade winds. Normally, they push warm air to the surface and they move towards Asia. However, in La Nina years, the trade winds are especially strong, so they push more of that warm surface water that's been heated by the sun and push it away. This allows colder water to rise up in the area where the warm water used to be, the eastern Pacific. Well, here's what happens next. We get a little change in our wintertime forecast. In the west, we'll be especially wet where warm and cool air collide. Towards the east coast, we'll have more wet conditions, and here in the southeast, we'll be especially dry dry and especially warm. So that's La Nina. That's how it works. And that's the forecast that it gives us as a result. Stay tuned because we'll talk about El Nino when that becomes our new forecast starting in just a few months. If you have a weather question, be sure to email it to me at Gianello at waytv.com because I would just love to hear from you.